Hello everyone. Um, so I'm back again with another video. Um, I just wanted to post this video because I uh, managed to injure my finger, as you can see, and that means that I'm not going to be able to work so much on my projects here as I want to, because it hurts like shit. Um, and when that's it, uh, I still did manage to finish up some stuff, so you can play test it yourself. Uh, which I really hope that you will if you own an HTC Vive set. Um, so, I'm just going to give you a brief introduction to what you can do with this. This, um, this is the level that you're going to get. So, uh, when you get into the level, you're going to start out with this. And depending on your size, it may look a little bit different uh, or weird. Um, so on your right shoulder button, you can press it down. It says not calibrated right now. So if you press that, it's going to bring up this image here. And that basically tells you that you should take a T-pose and press your, both your grip buttons. So when you do that, it's going to say that little ding sound. And then it's hopefully resizing you so that... Um, If you stand like this, it should you should be standing straight. So, um, for example, if, with my daughter, she when she has her arm all straight straightened up, uh, he would normally look like this. So that is why it comes in handy with smaller or bigger people. Um, the right and uh, the left shoulder button right now it says field of view off. So if you press that, it's gonna toggle on and off. The field of view limiter. So right now I have it on, have it on. So if I walk around, you can see it limits my view, uh, and especially when I'm turning and moving. What the fuck? Oh. So anyway, I'm just going to turn it off for now, and I put a mirror here for you to play around with. Um, yeah, that's an exit. Uh, the right track pad still has a teleport, so you can teleport around if you uh, prefer that. Uh, the jumping uh, is still, I mean, you know, I'm going to do this once because it hurts like shit on my finger. So, wah, fuck. Okay, anyway, uh, hands on where you head and pull down. And depending on how much speed you have, you're going to jump further. Um, sorry, I didn't have time to put in a, a jump animation. And I don't have any climbing animation as well. Um, so that's something you'll have to wait to see. Um, oh, this is very important. I think that is very important. <laughs> I have more boxes at the top by the way so you can if you want you can climb up and I'm probably going to fall down fuck shit okay anyway there are more boxes up there you can throw off yes um anything else I want to say yeah yeah this one uh as you can see I can't pass through it and I can't just walk in room scale, that's just not gonna let me do it. But I can duck underneath and get to the other side, which is very handy. It does something here, it's supposed to do. Ugh. Okay, um, and yeah, if you wanna exit, just head to the exit. Boom, there we go. So, yeah, that was uh, what I had for this video. I hope you enjoy this and um, I hope that you will, you will uh, post a lot of comments on this, uh, letting me know what you think in terms of um, controls, um, the locomotion, how does it work for you, do you get uh, nausea, um, uh, anything you think of when you try this uh, will be appreciated so um, yeah hope to hear from you and bye for now